What's up everyone, it's Smith here from GamersHeroes.com and today we've got a real quick eye for you in Star Wars Jedi Survivor on how to use the floating balloons, droids that you see sort of hovering around the map. Um, you can find these on Kobo very early in the game, like in the first few hours. Um, so you may sort of struggle to figure out what's going on. You can't use them until much, much later in the game. So you have to come to the observatory location and use this workbench. So this is part of the story. I'm being intentionally vague because this is quite a pivotal part. And if I give you any names and stuff, it's going to spoil it. But once you get to this point, you can't miss it because you have to learn it to progress in the story. So don't worry about missing it. Just continue with the main story. You'll pick it up. It's about 10, 15 hours, maybe a bit more. It is quite lengthy. Uh, once you've got it, you can then just ping between these balloons through the air so you can unlock new areas on Kobo as well as other areas in the game. Hey guys, nice and quick, nice and easy. Get with you and get back to the game. If we helped you out today, do like and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care now.